What's going on everybody? Hope you guys are doing well today. Welcome to another ride along. Today's gonna be an interesting one. I don't know if it will be interesting because we'll make a lot of money. Because trust me guys, it doesn't look like we're having a great day today. But I don't know, I just wanted to make a video because it's no secret that Instacart has been terrible lately super slow i need to make videos i need to create content and i don't like to make videos when it's super slow because there's really nothing interesting according to what i think right to record when it is so slow and there's no orders out there for me it's very difficult to come up with ideas of you know how to make content how to create videos and stuff well i'm gonna tell you this i've only done a 44 dollar order this morning at around 850 i took it i think and then right now it's 1227 and just right now i got my second order and it's not like it's a banger or anything it's a little $28 dole from Costco, going six miles, only nine items though. It's gonna be easy, but it's obviously not the best order ever. I just took it because I wanna make money and I wanna make videos for you guys. I just wanted to share my thoughts with you guys because whenever it's like this, I get very annoyed very kind of upset because while my situation thankfully it's not like I need the money 100% because I need to pay for something today or tomorrow thankfully I'm not in that position guys because my wife and I plan ahead for everything and we've been able to always be ahead of our bills two, three, or four weeks in advance, even five weeks in advance. Obviously, we do need the money, but we're not with that sort of stress. Like, hey, we need to make the money because then we will not be able to pay for whatever bill, you know? Thankfully, we are not in that position, guys. Um, I know it's not the same for everybody. Everybody has different situations and whatnot but while we're not in that position thankfully who doesn't like to be working you know and making money right so i get very annoyed of like instacart being so slow and being out there looking for orders there's nothing then i start thinking like hey i could have done this or that you know personal things instead of being out there waiting for orders. It is very frustrating. So I just said right now, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm gonna make content anyways. I'm gonna go out there. I'm gonna change my mindset and be positive. And that's what I wanna share with y'all. I don't wanna share any of my negativity because when it's slow and I tend to not record because of that, it also has to do a lot with my energy and the fact that it's not the right energy that I want to share with you guys in my videos but you know what I don't care anymore we're gonna change our mindset I'm gonna be positive and this is what I'm gonna share with y'all let's go get that money $28 nine items Costco two customers 6.8 miles let's get it I just dropped the first order off. It's a nine minute drive to the second order. I had to do one refund. So the batch will go down a little bit. I don't really mind it, guys. I'm gonna try to make that money. Um, I already have my plan coming up. This second drop off will leave me pretty much in the bubble of a Publix. So I will most likely wait over there. Hopefully we can get some more orders. 
although the wait times are very high hopefully we can get something without waiting too long at least a $20 order or whatever it is to kind of keep making that money please consider subscribing to the channel right now if you haven't done so give me a like if you're enjoying the video and comment down below comment 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 I read every single one of your comments and I try to respond most of them so thank you so much for your support good luck today damn guys see what I'm talking about it's very easy to get unmotivated my wife just missed a $105 order at Costco so you start wondering like what if I didn't take this order and I was there at Costco maybe I would have gotten the 105 but nobody knows nobody knows it is sad but we gotta keep going try to move on and uh, kind of block our minds from allowing stuff like this to affect us <sighs> although it hurts it's really it's really hard Right, people I'm here at Publix waiting nothing so far not a single order my wife had called me to tell me about the 105 she missed she said the batch popped up and she opened it and accepted it like a thousand times and it wouldn't get accepted and it never got accepted and then the batch popped up like two or three times after that and she opened it every single time and try to accept it and it didn't exist no more it's crazy and she had literally not seen anything for for like an hour or so she hasn't done any orders today in fact and uh, that was the first doable order she got today and that happens it's so frustrating guys I don't know what to do right now because it's been dead. I haven't seen a single order since I delivered. I don't know where I should go. It seems like wherever I go, it's the same exact thing. Not seeing anything. But I'm online on Uber Eats. And let me check if I can go online on DoorDash too. Nope, can't go online there. I don't know what to do but there's nothing going on <sighs> I'm gonna wait a couple more minutes here and uh, if I don't see anything then I'll move on to a different store I guess and believe it or not right after this clip my wife called me to say she had also missed a $78 order at Costco same thing again she was in the Instacart app and she opened up the batch as soon as it popped up and guess what? It no longer existed. So I knew I had to make a move. It was obvious that there were bangers popping at Costco. But the question was, would I get lucky there considering I didn't see any good orders earlier there? Let's find out. Thank goodness, guys. I just grabbed a $97 order. Can't believe it, man. I'm shaking. I don't know what to feel right now. I'm kind of speechless. It is Costco with Target, though. And it is Target first. I'm here at Costco, and I got to drive across the street to go to Target first and shop for seven items over there and then come back to Costco, which is a bit annoying, but I mean, <laughs> I'm not gonna complain. And Target is across the street, like I said, so it's no big deal. And yeah, of course, right now I'm getting Uber Eats offers, but when I'm waiting with absolutely no orders, they won't show me anything, so <laughs> it's crazy. What a blessing, man. I can't believe it. I love you guys. 
Good luck for you guys today. Let's go. Let's go make that money. Got every single item. Took me 13 minutes only. Let's go check out. Here's my little GoPro setup, by the way. All right, heading out. I hope this video is serving as motivation for you guys because we could be having a terrible day and hear all these things about um, somebody else getting a $100 order or you know in my case my wife missing it and then missing a 78 and a few minutes ago she actually missed a 58 she hasn't done any orders she hasn't been able to take any orders the orders hit her screen 
and they're already gone by the time she's able to open them and that happens that happens a lot especially now that I feel like a lot of people are cheating you know using bots and stuff like that so anyways we gotta be prepared to have stuff like this happen to us like missing orders and stuff like that but we gotta be able to keep going bro like this order was so unexpected i wasn't expecting to to even get a 40 dollar order guys like it's been trash for me and like i said i was waiting there at costco while my wife missed a 78 and i didn't see that one and then boom i got this one and my wife didn't see this one so it's crazy guys it's so crazy but anyways i hope this video is motivating you let's make that money got that order done in an hour and 20 minutes which is acceptable for a double store order to be honest that was a nice order man I I can't believe it I'm so thankful but now it's 3 15 and I think I'm gonna go home because I haven't had lunch yet and I'm hungry and uh, we'll see what we're getting next I'll let you guys know Okay, as I was driving by this Walgreens right here, I got a $16 batch for three miles, nine items. I just completed the shopping and it's going towards my house. So it's gonna leave me close to have lunch. So it works for me. Let's get it. I was arriving home and a $45 order popped up for Costco with Sam's Club. It is not the best order in the world. It's going 16 miles and it's 10 items over at Costco and 16 at Sam's Club or 14, I don't know. I was able to pick up my lunch. My wife had already made it. So she put it in the container to go container and I'm good. I'm eating on my way to Costco. So let's do that. All right, guys, that's the Costco order along with this. And we'll be heading out to Sam's Club shortly. Let's go. Believe it or not, I couldn't find any boxes here at Costco for that order or well, that order. That other little box is my personal stuff. that I keep kind of together my snacks and water and stuff. But I will try to find an extra box over at Sam's Club to get the Costco one. So anyway, let's go. All right, this is a Sam's Club order. Took me a little bit over 10 minutes to get all the items. It's pretty easy, we found everything. Let's go check out and get it dropped off. I did do one refund over at Costco, I forgot to mention. So go down a couple bucks maybe, we're good. Seems like we have tons of traffic ahead of us. Look at that, guys. It's foggy, super foggy. But whatever, man. Let's keep going. The other side, though, is much, much worse. They're like literally parked. Traffic there on that section of the interstate is crazy, man. The other day, my friend George who also does Instacart, he got into some traffic there and it took him about an hour and 20 minutes to go back to the zone. 
for only about four miles on the highway because there was some fire going on. The fire wasn't even on the road. That's the craziest thing. It was on some trees and, you know, plants on the side of the road. The grass just caught on fire randomly. It was like a one hour delay for that. It was crazy, man. Alrighty. Guys, I got a $26 Publix. That's not the best order in the world. Okay, it's going 11 miles but it's getting me out of this area where I don't want to be at. So I just took it because of that. And it wasn't that many items. It was like 20 items. So I got the shopping done in like 12 minutes. We'll be done with this in under an hour. It's good. I just ran across this other Instacart shopper that I always see around. And uh, he was waiting and he showed me his phone and he was at $69 for the day. And I was like, man, I've been there, bro. All these last few days, it's been like that for me. So I feel you. Got that last order done in 43 minutes or so and i just picked up a 20 dollar uber eats for nine miles 9.8 miles or something it's not the greatest but keeps me moving it's decent so i'm gonna try to knock it out as quick as possible while instacart gives me something it looks like instacart is really slow right now and uh, food delivery is what's popping so we're gonna try to take advantage of that and i'll let you guys know what we're getting next okay we got the order in here let's go drop it off currently 16 minutes away let's go and after that my mom called me so i couldn't record but i got this six dollar uber eats and a couple more DoorDash orders for a total of $13.50 there. I made $26.91 on Uber Eats and $257.37 on Instacart for a total of $297.78. Thank you so much for watching, guys.